Hey, welcome back. Um, I got uh, my vegetarian wrap made with my um, tofu crumble, um, caramelized onions, garlic, basil, and um, my two my two uh, Star Wars edition limited edition hot sauces. If I can go get some more, I'm gonna probably buy them all. Um, they're delicious. I recommend them. You can get them at your local Walmart or a lot of a lot of places, but that's where I found mine. It was a local Walmart, and uh, you will not be disappointed. I promise you. Um, and you would think if you buy anything Star Wars brand, you would be paying a lot of money, but really they're very affordable. Um, uh, for all of the hot sauces in one package, they're about $14 approximately plus tax, so that's not too bad. And th I'm Canadian, so that's Canadian. I can't promise anybody the, uh, the U.S. prices, but um, it still be worth it. Okay, let me flip the camera around. Let's do this. Okay, so there's my wrap. Just in case it's hot, not hot enough for me. I got my uh, habanero, habanero hot sauce. All right, so I'm gonna dig into it and then um, and then see if I need the habanero sauce. I don't think I'm going to, but I probably will, anyways. Okay, so let's do this. This Kurt crave the heat. Now this is really well balanced with the um, tofu crumble, <clears throat> just caramelized onions, and then actually the raw red onions as well. They work really well together, they really do. Um, and then the sour cream, I put sour cream in it, uh, just to, you know, kind of give it a, a bit of freshness. That is really working right now. Hmm. Hmm. Wow. That is good. I'm not tooting my own horn or anything, but that is good. Hmm. <clears throat> Move away with my chef's knife for a moment. Uh, it took me about. It took me about an hour to make that tofu crumble. Uh, you have to be really careful with uh, with tofu because um, you can easily you can easily screw it up. But just be patient with tofu. Um, anyway. Mmm, dripping. That is really, really good. <clears throat> Anybody that is um is vegetarian and trying to crave the heat, I recommend this. If you want to ask uh, any questions about uh, different ideas with tofu or any kind of vegetarian options, still craving that heat and not using meat, you can still crave the heat without using the meat. Um, then seriously hit me up because I have so many different ideas which will be coming on the channel as well. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Wow. Wow. Oh. That is good. That is a good midnight snack. Oh my god. I had to put some habanero on. 
hit one more time. Mm -hmm. mm. I love the idea of putting that sour cream in there. <clears throat> um, don't use any anything less than 4% sour cream, if possible. Unless you're on a dietary, you know, you're on a diet or... You can't, uh, you know, if you're lactose intolerant or whatever, there's a lot of lactose intolerant uh, options. Uh, however, if if that's not a restriction for you, then definitely go with 4% sour cream. Mm -hmm. Drip and habanero. Mm -hmm. This is wonderful. <clears throat> um, I'm probably going to do more episodes with uh, wraps as well. Because most of my episodes are with bagels. Because um, that's normally what I just have handy. But, um, <clears throat> but wraps keep all all your ingredients inside better they don't fall on, out on you as much hmm. that Star Wars hot sauce I am telling you that is well for me it's probably for me it's probably like a one and a half, two, I would say. But uh, beginners, it might be more like a four or five. But still, it what's important is the flavors there. That's what's most important. Mm hmm. Just keep in mind too. Excuse me, sir. There's my midnight snack. Always keep in mind when you're um, thinking about getting into being a chili head, um, it or just just craving the heat of any kind. Um, just be aware of what your diet consists of and your diet restrictions. <clears throat> Because um, some people can't even handle black pepper. You know. Um, uh, and and because it, it disrupts your system, it it can it can cause you pain. Um, so like when you're doing hot sauces or hot peppers, it can cause you discomfort. So don't 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 dive in head deep. Um, I did that at the beginning. I really did. And wow, did I regret that. So I started off slow, and that's what this channel is about. Okay? It's about starting off small, and, for, and, and, and just building up your tolerance. Okay? Because you don't want to dive in deep. I'm telling you right now, you do not want to dive in deep. It, um... You know, the, the YouTuber that I love so much, other than Johnny Scoville. Shout out, Johnny. Um, but uh, LA Beast, he dives in deep. And all the respect to him. But but holy damn, it it is really, it can be um, an adventure that you might not want to entertain. However, that's why my channel is about, um, about just beginners beginners like people that are starting from the bottom part starting from scratch but still have that passion to crave the heat all right and um 
that's what I'm all about, and I'm going to continue on that way with my channel. That's how it's going to go. Um, I, I might, I might up the level just a little bit, you know, once in a while, because I can handle more now that I build my tolerance up over probably, I'd say probably 10 years, almost 10 years. But I started off after I, after I started to, um, realized that I can't just dive in deep I started small and then um, after that because I was in I had what uh, chili heads call um, cap escasing cramps which is cap cramps if you want um, after that oh my god um, I started small after that and uh, I have never regretted a moment of it um, it's a, uh, it's it's a pleasurable thing. Capus casing oils in any any hot peppers or anything like that. Very 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 good for you. Um, and I can't go one night now without having some kind of heat, something, something, some kind of capus casing. It's uh, it becomes very addictive, but in a good way. It's not unhealthy for you. It's very healthy for you. So. Anyway, I'll keep this uh, video a little bit more short here. <laughs> uh, Kurt from Crave the Heat. I always crave the heat. See you on the next episode. Bye, my friends.